Welcome to your Cohesion Classroom. In this lesson, we will take a look at how to represent the number five in more than one way. At the end of this video, you will have access to our tips and takeaways, allowing you to focus on the content being presented. You can always access any of our tips and takeaways from the lesson page before or after watching the lesson. In kindergarten, students will begin to build a foundation for adding and subtracting by grouping various objects together to make one number. In this lesson, students will be asked to make different combinations of five now that they have learned how to read, write, and represent numbers one through five. Counters will be used to display different combinations to make the number five in a five frame. A five frame is a tool that is used for students to visualize the numbers from zero through five. Counters are colored circular objects that can be manipulated to represent a number. These are commonly used to help students visually see how many objects are in a group. Let's take a look at the different ways to make the number five. Using double-sided counters in a five frame, make the number five and write the number pairs. Students will be given five counters that are double-sided, meaning two colors, and asked to make the number five using the five frame. They will be given five frames to record the number of each color as they find a couple ways to make the number five. Let's start by placing one red counter in the five frame. The rest of the five frame can be filled with blue counters. Students should record one red counter and four blue counters. This shows one way to make the number five using our red and blue counters. Let's look at another way to make the number five using our counters. Students should place two red counters in the five frame and fill the rest of the five frame with blue counters. Two red counters and three blue counters show another way to make the number five. Students can continue to explore other ways to make the number five using this five frame. However, it is important for students to eventually see the pattern to make five by replacing one color counter at a time. To keep students from miscounting the counters, record them as you count and point to them in the five frame as shown here. Using our previous example of two red counters and three blue counters, students can record the number of each color counter here. Before finding various ways to make the number five, be sure that there are only five counters to begin with. Students often get this wrong just for mistakenly having an incorrect amount of counters to start with. Students should practice the different ways to make the number five by using the same two colors but changing the quantity of each color. Three red counters and two blue counters. This makes five counters altogether. Four red counters and one blue counter, there are still five counters altogether. To gain a full understanding of this concept, visit the lesson page to view the rest of the represent, read, write, and count number zero through five set of lessons. Uniting students and families in learning, we are Cohesion Education. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.